Hi there, Linda Artisani, Artisani Bookkeeping, and I'm here to do a quick tutorial on how to disconnect and reconnect your bank feed. So let's go right to my little Craig's landscaping. So I've seen this happen a couple of times actually this past week where people have been really quick to go to connect their account and they click on connect their account, they find their bank, and then they log in and connect the bank to the bank feed. And then when they do that, they don't connect the correct account. So what happens is they connect maybe their personal banking because maybe they've got it together all on one page with on like Bank of America's site and they connect their personal banking by accident to their business. So if that happens, I'm going to pretend that that's happened here. I've connected the wrong one. It has no clue. It doesn't match any of my transactions. It's, it's just completely not the right thing. You're going to come up here to the pencil, click edit your account info. And this is how you disconnect a bank feed. Click this button, disconnect this account on save and then save and close. Be careful when you do this though, because every transaction that's in here is going to be wiped out. So you're not going to have them there anymore to access. And if you can reconnect the bank feed, if they're not old transactions, then they'll come back. But if they're more than 90 days, you're going to have to go through the steps to connect to the bank and go in and download the file to bring all those other transactions in that are ancient. So you don't want to disconnect if you want to keep these in the feed. I would download them and then remove them. But in this case, we've just imported a bunch of garbage and we want to, it doesn't belong here in this business account. So we want to disconnect the feed. So when I hit save and close, you're going to see that all those transactions are now gone and the account is now gone. So there's no more checking account here. So if I wanted to reconnect, I'd have to come back to the home page and follow the steps here to reconnect my account that's no longer attached to the bank feed. So I come over here, click to connect the account, find my bank account, and then log in. So that's the steps to disconnect a bank account from the bank feed in QuickBooks Online. I hope that's helpful. Um, I'll be posting more videos. Please feel free to visit my Facebook page. It's Artisani Bookkeeping. You can do a search. And then if you have a request for help, I can create a video for you. So that would be another way to reach out to me. Or you can reach out to me directly at my website, which is www.artisanibookkeeping.com. You can see it right down here. That's www.artisanibookkeeping.com. Thank you.